<laughs> Good morning. Good morning. We had a hiccup of a day. Mm -hmm. We'll start to the day because it's light out. Mm -hmm. We overslept. But it's good. Okay. It's probably safe for this way because we went to bed at 1. We were going to get up at 3.30. So driving 20 hours and 2.5 and hours of sleep was not good. But we got up, got rested, and now we're heading to Chicago. Mm-hmm. Roadside snacks? Check. Breakfast? Check. Check. We are 212 miles in. We left with not a full tank, and we kind of planned it because we just wanted to get out of the state and on the road since we slept in, but we're in the first exit into Georgia, so we are out of Florida for the next week. And look at these two goons over here. They're just over there having a blast. Eve literally was so good. It's so amazing what a, what six months makes for a puppy because she we had to stop like every two hours. Um, I almost like every almost have every hour hour and a half for her to go to the bathroom and she's so much older now but she couldn't make it she made it halfway through that parking lot and just had to go to the bathroom but now she's over there stretching her legs she hasn't slept at all in the car so I'm sure she's gonna be ready for a little sleep we're it's 1230 we are deep we're four hours deep the dog Still fighting a nap, and usually she's asleep now, but she's just, she may have just gotten comfy. But we, I made a decision that I haven't even told Sarah yet. In the, we drive through three major states, going from Florida to Illinois, and it's Florida, Georgia, and Illinois. You go, oh, and Tennessee. And so Kentucky. Four. Kentucky's for like 30 miles or something like that. It's not for like, it's less than 100 miles. So here's what I want to do. For all the four major states, the Florida, Georgia, Kentucky and Illinois. Wait, no, Tennessee. Tennessee and Illinois. We're gonna listen to the entire Hamilton Broadway show. But we've already done Florida and we're out of it, so we're in Georgia, but Georgia's like the longest state we have. So we're gonna take a break and gonna switch over to Pandora and then listen to some illuminations because Carolyn and Ben hooked us up specifically for road trip tunes. Yeah. Thank you, but I'm I'm too it's too early right now. I need it to be a little bit later in the afternoon to listen to the it illuminations. Just, like, pump us up. Yes, because it's gonna pump me up and then it's also gonna put me to sleep a little. And sleeping while driving is not a safe or good thing. And we have all kinds of tripods and gadgets and gizmos, so we're all doing all this hands free. Promise. See? to get through Atlanta before rush hour and I think we are just Atlantic trap is just so bad mm -hmm. Eve got sick of taking a nap so she's driving for me mm -hmm. and it started to rain it's just gloomy out and we're almost at under 50 degree weather take a look at this this is literally just our pace Going 15 miles an hour. Where's that stadium? What's that called again? Turner Field. There's Turner Field. Hey Jordan! What up Jordan? Sorry we, we bailed on breakfast. We we're supposed to meet up with our friend Jordan who lives here for breakfast and coffee. But that was back when we were uh That was back when we were supposed to get up at 3 a.m. 3 a.m. and we got up at 
almost seven. Yeah, we we're gonna have breakfast here. It's three forty. Yeah, it's three forty. So a little change of plan though. It's okay. Yeah. I feel like I said I probably uh -oh. feel probably feel much. I'd probably be asleep right now yeah. while driving, which is not safe. Oh, we have to listen to Hamilton. Oh yeah, we have to listen to Hamilton oh, before the state's over. <laughs> so we're gonna listen to Hamilton, and we probably only have like 150 miles left in Georgia. Someone's tired. Eve's just taking a little snooze. So cute. Sarah running with Eve in a field while we wait for our, our dinner. Grabbing some hearties, which I don't think we've ever had. But Sarah's letting Eve burn some energy out there next to the highway. We look like crazy people. But you gotta do what you gotta do. With them, she got to run a little bit, she went to the bathroom, and she's ready for the last string. It's 6 p.m. The iPhone says we'll get to Chicago at 2 a.m. So we still got a stretch, good stretch to go. We're about, we're about to go through the mountains, which it's been since 2014 since I drove through the mountains. I have driven through the mountains before at night. It's just been since 2014. It gets a little crazy, but this car has been driving very well on the highway, so I feel pretty safe. A little Nashville action. There's a little Nashville. It's 7.30. And we're currently debating if we're gonna find a place to spend the night. Yeah. We thought we found an Airbnb. It was never an Airbnb, so we were like very weary of it. We went to go book it and there was like an extra $40 in fees. So we're back to the drawing board. We're on our last road. The signs say 57 North to Chicago. We still have like four hours left, but we're on our last road. We're at 37 degrees. And we are here. We are here. We're like a mile down the main street from Sarah's mom. Look at Evers, <laughs> the window looking. She's looking. ready for bed. Uh huh. I think we all are. I'm Guys, beyond exhausted. We actually called two different hotels. Yeah. And we were gonna stay. We were on the expressway. Sarah called this hotel, and we were on this expressway, but the other one was on this expressway. 15 minutes off of this one because they're going in completely different directions on interstate to the middle of nowhere. That 15 minutes meant an hour to get to the other one. So we're yeah. like, what's the, we're two and a half hours away from home. Why well, drive an hour Back. out of the direction just to sleep yeah. when we could drive another hour and a half just to get home and not spend the money. So yeah, we're about five minutes away from my mother's. And then we can go to bed. Yeah. <sighs> we're, we're knackered. Yes, we are definitely knackered and shattered. Look at our little fort. This is this is our fort for the week. We have a barrier to keep Eve isolated. There's her bed. There's our bed. Here's sleepy Eve. Here's sleepy Sarah. And here's the the dad to be himself. He's about to be what? Twenty. Future YouTuber. It's cool. Future YouTuber. And future 21. Put down below if you would follow a YouTube of Grant and Christina and Violet traveling around the world. We're very interesting. They are. Put a happy early birthday down below. 21. 21. And with that? It's good to be home. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled 
at Walt Disney Productions.